Now we'll discuss environment. Environment can be biological. It can be psychological. It can be physical. It can be social. What is biological environment? Environment, a bacteria, virus, parasites. This is biological environment. What is psychological environment? Interactions. Mental health. Reactions to normal situations or abnormal situations. This is psychological environment. Someone working in stressful conditions is not mentally healthy. It affects the health. Physical environment. Heat, cold, light, radiation. They affect social environment, interaction with other. All these affect the health status of a community or people. If there is greater dose of bacteria, virus, or someone is not psychologically healthy, there is extreme heat, extreme light, extreme cold. They play, they, they provide a favorable environment. They affect the health status. Someone may not interact normally with his colleagues, with his neighbors. So, we can say agent, host, environment. All these interact and produce a disease process. Agent invades the host. It needs a favorable, favorable environment for growth. So, let's apply this on some disease like measles. We can apply this triangle on measles. What is the agent of measles? Paramyxovirus. Host. Children under 5 years are susceptible to develop measles. So host is children under 5 years. Environment. Poor sanitation. Low socioeconomic status or poor people. And malnutrition. This is epidemiological trial of measles. It's a common question in exams. They say children of two years have developed rash. He has complex spots, which is diagnostic sign of measles. And lives in poor environment. He has low socioeconomic status. He is malnourished. Diagnose the disease. You may say measles. And then they say draw and label epidemiological triad. So you have to write agent name paramyx the virus. Host, according to scenario, two years. Environment, poor sanitation, low socioeconomic status, malnutrition. So this was all about today. Now, we'll summarize our discussion. We have discussed community medicine. The medicine which is applied on a community are a comprehensive health system which is provided by a healthcare team to improve the health of communities, community medicine, or it deals with the problems of community. Then we discuss what is health, physical, mental, social, well-being, not merely that is a disease, health and community medicine. Then we discuss natural history of disease, how disease process progresses, how an agent invades and causes the disease process. What is the outcome? And we discussed epidemiological triad. Agent, host and environment, they cause the disease. They interact with each other and cause the disease process. So our uh, today's lecture was all about that. Thank you very much. Okay.